Well, you'd think that with Europe's debt crisis swirling around its biggest bankroller, Germany, that it might be dominating the country's political landscape. Instead, the people there are rounding on the president to quit after he threatened a newspaper against revealing a home loan scandal he's embroiled in. And support is shifting to a new party that has no official stance on the EU or its troubles. As Igor Piskunov reports now from Berlin. It looks like an ordinary scene at one of the many bars in Berlin. Except there is one thing which makes this party totally different from all the others. The party's name is Piratenpartei Deutschland and transl literally translated the Pirate Party Germany. That's right. This is an annual meeting of a political party and all these people are among its 18,000 members across Germany. Like Dmitri, who is tired of the mainstream. And I was really disappointed. And, uh, um, it is, um, uh, always the same way, you have uh, uh, the faces and you have uh, almost no content and the Pirate Party was really different. One of its key differences, apart from the style in general, is a software system called Liquid Feedback, allowing ordinary Germans the opportunity to propose policies online. The Pirates stand for more transparency and freedom on the Internet. But when it comes to core issues like the economy... No, we don't have currently a stand on this, this crisis. We maybe will have after the uh, next federal uh, convention. But this wasn't a problem at the previous election for the Berlin state parliament, when the Pirate Party managed to win nearly 9% of the vote, securing 15 seats. Most people who I talk to, they say, um, you're something new, you're something fresh, and we like that, because many Germans believe that politics are rusty at this time. As the big players struggle with the key economic and political issues, the Pirate Party doesn't even have an official stance on the Eurozone crisis or the Arab Spring. Nevertheless, it continues gathering more supporters. A mere coincidence or an alarming signal for mainstream politicians. The Free Democrats Party, which is Angela Merkel's federal coalition partner, is the first to feel the change of heart from voters. It actually lost that Berlin vote, along with another four local votes across the country. A mainstream politics is also losing um, attractiveness because there is often too little distinction or distinctiveness between different parties from different um, fields or areas. Sometimes it's even difficult to tell the difference between conservatives and social democrats. Experts say the Pirate Party's key success tool is the Internet and see it as the new driving force changing politics similar to the way it was influenced by TV over half a century ago. So unless the mainstream parties adapt and change their tactics, it may not be too long before they could find themselves on the margins. Igor Piskunov, RT, Germany.